Hey, it's Tommy Fast Coop, and I'm gonna need you to like, share, and subscribe to the channel. The crib. Hey, Tommy, you trying to talk about you ain't hating. I just seen the DM conversation. You said to that girl, I'll delete you for real. You probably still messing with your broke ass baby daddy. You probably still in that nigga. That's what you said, Ray Tommy. You can't sit here and make it seem like that's not hating at the end of the day. You try to run off with the the uh, response saying, oh, I'm not hating. I'm just calling him broke. It's the truth. He's broke. Now you're being delusional, homie. You trying to actually believe the lie that you present to the public. At the end of the day, you was hating, bro. If you got to speak down on any other man just to get some attention from a female, it's crazy. And then in reality, you the catch. You don't got to act like that. But niggas get so caught up in this toxic mentality. They think that shit's cool. Now you look like a pillow talking to the rest of the world. So now the fans that you have who's broke and who's from the streets and who got baby mamas, they going to feel like you would do that to them because they're no different from that nigga because they broke and they got a baby mama that's messing with rap niggas and all type of shit. So now you got to understand, Rich Homie, you was just making your way back like you didn't get to where you once was, but you was getting back. You was getting, you know, some fans and getting back in the conversation. But you keep popping up here and there. Okay, they try to say you had to go in and speak in terms of Young Thug and, you know, his case or whatever the case is. You had to take the stand or whatever it was. I don't know if that was true or not, but then your name got brought up as some negative stuff because they trying to associate you with, you know, snitching, right? Then... You know, you got this situation. So now you got pillow talking and then they try to say, you know, you was talking to the cops in terms of, you know, you let them know what happened in terms of thug. We don't know exactly what you said, but we do know that you spoke with them. So at the end of the day, homie, and I'm a big rich homie fan. You feel me? My Instagram used to be rich homie KB back in the gap. You feel me? Can't argue with me. Now you like blah, 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 blah. Walk in. Feel like the man of the year. You know what I mean? All of those. I know, I know, I know. I know all them drums by heart. You feel me? But what would you do? Yeah, all of them things. You feel me? Hey, yo, Rich, help me go hard. But anyway, yeah, Rich, you got to stop doing all the sucker behavior, man. You got to clean it up a little bit, man. Go apologize to that, man. Now, send him 5000 Seven twenty five hundred. If you really a broke ass nigga, man. It's so, man. You feel me? You different. That man just trying to see his kids, man. That's all he's trying to do, but you over here being a bitch homie coin. That's what you being. You being a bitch homie, man. So make sure y'all like, share, and subscribe to the channel. The crib.